Hey everybody and welcome to my brand new Let's Play. Haven't decided exactly what to call it yet, but it'll probably be called um, Single Mom of Septuplets or um, Seven Kids and Counting or something cool and creative. You saw it, it was in the video, it was in the title of the video. But the uh, what I'm here to do today is I have grabbed this sim off of the gallery. Um, her name is Ruby Mullins, which is a randomized name that I gave her. And I went ahead and gave her seven infants, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And they're also all color-coded by the colors of the rainbow. Um, and today we are going to start a Let's Play where this single mom of septuplets is going to raise them from infancy all the way until they graduate high school and move out. So, um, we're starting today with seven infants, and I'll give you guys a quick look at her outfits. Um, nothing too crazy, and we can go further with it as we get through but I really want this to be a story based kind of thing as well as just a challenge to keep seven infants and toddlers and children alive but yeah let's get started alrighty so here we are um <laughs> they're all out on the sidewalk now um I grabbed this house off of the gallery as well and it was uh, intended for a single mom and I did add this extension over here on the left um to house all of the infant stuff we need and I figured as we get um, different art and stuff, we can decorate it like that. And, you know, even divide up the room to make it fit seven or expand the house or move if we need to. Um, but other than that, it's um, there's a little bathroom here at the front, living room, a little desk, um, kitchen in here, bathroom, and then the mom's room. And then, of course, the space for the infants. I haven't decided what job I'm going to get her yet because uh, this is not going to be like a 100 Babies thing where you know, she has to do it all on her own or anything. We're going to make it realistic. You know, if you could afford a nanny, you would get one, that kind of thing. So we're definitely going to be hiring a nanny, um, having a job, all of that other stuff, because this challenge is going to be hard enough. This Let's Play, excuse me, is going to be hard enough um, <laughs> without the addition of extra rules to restrict this. So this is, it's just a Let's Play. I guess challenge, it is going to be challenging, but it is more of a um, Let's Play of imagining um that ruby here you know got pregnant with septuplets seven babies in one and whoever their father is peaced out because you know he's not trying to deal with that so um now she's left to deal with seven babies on her own and even though she does have her own home and she'll have a job here in a minute seven babies is tough regardless so i think first before you put them in there let's just go ahead and get her a job I made her aspiration the uh, big happy family. Let me see, does she have any skills? Oh, wow. Okay, that, that's wrong. Let me uh, cheat that away because that's not right. Um, she's already pretty high up on all of the cooking stuff, so I might uh, do the culinary career. So let's just do that for now, and she can change later if she wants. Now for the hard part. Let's go ahead and get all of these babies in here. Let's see, who is this? That's Monday. So let's go ahead and put Saturday here. Put Sunday here, put Thursday here, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then put Friday to sleep there. Let's see how well this goes, because I don't have high hopes. But anyway, yeah, so she is in the culinary career now, and whenever she has to go to work and stuff, we're hiring a nanny. We're probably going to hire a nanny pretty soon anyways. I've seen um, James Turner and um, Little Simsy do the seven infant challenge, and they hired nannies or had people come stay over and stuff. I am not going to say that I'm not going to do that because I definitely probably will um because <clears throat> that's what you would do in real life if you had septuplets and honestly it's probably even unfair that she has just popped into existence and doesn't have like parents to come over and help her and that kind of a thing so um it does seem like she is kind of alone in terms of like other adults that can come and help her and stuff but she can make friends and um I am kind of hoping that Eleanor Sullivan decides to come visit us and that kind of thing but um we will see I guess um I'm really excited for this Let's Play. I like Ruby as a Sim. I'm hoping that we can really get into her kind of resolve and um, just really help. She's a teen. Why is her hair gray? Pause. Oh, it's a beanie. Sorry. Um, really hoping that I can get really into this Sim and, um, you know, just play through her life. Um, she was a well-off young adult surprise septuplets and uh now we're here so um she's handling it like a champ of course let's just go ahead and bring these babies in come on but um 
you know, this is going to be a challenge regardless to try to raise seven happy, successful children. <laughs> Come on, bring her inside. Oh boy. All right, you can do it. Yeah, well, you don't have Friday anymore. All right, yes, bring Wednesday inside. I do think this will be a little bit hard, and I'm not sure if I'll need to turn off autonomy or anything. Probably will end up turning off autonomy. Um, go ahead and bring... Who is this? Go ahead and bring Sunday inside. And then we'll bring Tuesday inside. Oh, the names are based off of what happened to Monday from Netflix. I don't know if any of you guys have watched that, but... Um, I didn't just start with Wednesday and then get creative. I stole it from what happened to Monday, where it's a show about... A mandatory one sibling law and um, you have to all right go ahead and put her down and um, this dude had this lady had septuplets and their grandpa's raising them and each of them can only go outside on their specified day of the, day of the week according to their name uh, so that's cool that's where I got the names from go ahead and wake these kids up because they need to come inside and then as you can see I color code them so that one's yellow that one's green um, bring inside yeah Bring inside. It's been like six hours and I'm just now getting them all in the house. <laughs> but they should stay there after that. I don't see why they wouldn't. Come on. There we go. All the way in. Put Wednesday down here. Yeah, it doesn't matter which one. Just put her down. Great. And then go ahead and put Friday in a crib as well. All right, all right. Leave this child alone, please. Thank you. There we go. All seven of them are in a crib in any moment now. Wonderful. So I know they won't all like sleep a whole night or anything. And I also know that when one of them starts crying, they all start crying. So while they're all at least laying down, I'm going to try to sleep because at this moment she is exhausted. And I am going to go ahead and turn off autonomy. Um, I don't think that that, I think she'll still respond to infant cries regardless, but it's worth a shot. Um, Let's see if everybody can sleep for a few minutes. Alrighty. Everybody's awake, so that means you need to be awake. Now, immediately all seven being awake and upset, I'm going to go ahead and call a nanny. Because there's no reason to think that you have to do it alone, kids. If you ever have septuplets, you got to call a nanny. Um, and we have money to do it. We have 5,000 simoleons, so that is no big deal. Now go ahead and call this nanny. Alright, now go here. And yes, it's 3 a.m. We just called a nanny. But that's okay. Um, let's see who is worse for wear. Hungry, 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 hungry. Um, well, let's go in age order then. Um, boop. And then I have also seen it's easier to do it from infant to mom. So to do get fed by Ruby instead of um, the other way around. Hold on. Help. Get fed by Ruby. Okay. Well, uh, my sibling's getting fed first, but... Oh, well, maybe. They're not in order, which is really messing with me. I don't know why they're not in order. Um, get fed. Please feed me, please. No, no. No, no. Go ahead and... Feed. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Is this how it's going to be? Because I can't do this. Okay. Yep. Fed one. Great. Oh, great. The nanny's here. Wonderful. Oh, and also for their traits, I'm not sure if I showed this, but I gave, there's six infant traits and seven infants, so I did one trait. Each, all of the traits are represented, and then I think there's two wiggly infants. So, there are, oh no, <laughs> they both went for the same one. Oh, that was crazy. Yeah, yeah, we're trying to feed Sunday. Where is Sunday? Sunday, help! Megumi, help! Feed me! Help! Dude, please, I'm begging. Thank you very much. Please tell me you're feeding me. Come on. You can do it. There we go. She wants it, trust me. All right, Mom, you can't have favorites, okay? You can't just hold Sunday the whole time. Gotta come take care of all your other babies, too. 
Um, I'll probably, I'm not sure how often I'll do the episodes for this, but certainly at least once a week. Um, I've been trying to make a video once a week, so I'm not sure if I'll just keep doing this one over and over or if I'll, there might be a build challenge sprinkled in between, but um, I'm enjoying this so far, so no reason to believe why. No reason to believe it shouldn't be this next or whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about, y'all. It's late. Um, all right. Next question. Will you feed your children? That's kind of what I'm thinking. All right. Can we reset you or something? Because I feel like you're being more buggy than people even normally are. Who's the most hungry right now? Oh, you're angry. Hello. All right, Mom. Come and feed your child. Baby care. Feed. Breastfeed. Go. Yes, yes, you're tense. Yeah, I don't like the crying either. You know why they're crying? Because you're not feeding them. So that's what's going on right now. Can she walk in between? Like, is this an issue of like how far apart the cribs are? I don't feel like it should be. Because she's literally stood there for like 20 minutes and did nothing. All right. Feed the baby. Great. One down. <laughs> and then Megumi, I am going to need you to fix some of the other babies as well. Um, oh my God, are they all early risers? Sunday, Monday, Thursday, Tuesday, Saturday. Thank you, Wednesday, for being the only one that isn't an early riser, I think. Oh my god. How long does it take to feed a child? Come on. Come on. You can do it. Feeding Tinkler. Alright. That's crazy. Okay. Um, Wednesday's very hungry. Oh no. Oh, which one's Wednesday? <laughs> Alright. Help! All right, come feed me, please. I'm dying. Okay. Hate's being held. Oh, that's not good. Imagine being a nanny and getting called and <laughs> being like, yeah, hey, I have seven four-month-olds. Can you please come help me? Also, it'll take the entire shift just for us to feed all of them once. So um, if that this is going to be a problem for you. All right. Oh god, this one's next. Help! Feed me! Alright, you're sleeping. You need to sleep good. You're good, so go ahead and try to go night-night and we'll bathe you later. You go ahead and try go night-night. You're, like, wearing yourself out just being hungry. Okay, you need to be fed. Help! Ruby is gonna have to sleep soon. Um, great. Now you try go night-night. Uh, yeah, you can sleep on the floor for now. <laughs> and... <laughs> You try go night night. Wonderful. Now, who still needs to be fed, if anyone? You do, but you're actively being fed. All right. Pretty good. Um, now, who is smelly? Looks like no one on this side, but I know you are. So, Saturday. Oh, it's going to be hard to switch between their things. Saturday. I'm going to say go ahead and wake up and let's get a bath from you. Just, um, can I click on the bath and do it? Yeah, get a bath from Megumi and go ahead and start this mess. Because they can sleep without any interference, but they do need help being fed and stuff. Um, all right, now you're about to die, so let's go, <laughs> let's go ahead and get this sorted out. Go ahead and pee and, oh, the house is set up different than I thought it was. Um... And then just do something quick, because you don't really have time to cook right now. I have some cold cuts. <laughs> you can do it. Alright. Don't do that. Now go eat. Good. That's crazy. Now, go to sleep. Are all the babies asleep right now? Crazy. This is awesome. Why aren't you being bathed? Oh, you're fine. Never mind. I mean, you have a stink cloud, so I think you need your diaper change, but... Um, how about you go ahead and do that, actually? Just so we can maybe solve stuff before it needs solved. Great. Back to sleep you go. All right, Megumi. Whoa. <laughs> What's going on out here? Wolfgang. What are you doing, man? Oh, that's crazy. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh so hard. Okay. 
Who's a sensitive infant? Okay, well, good for you. First blowout. Oh, Jesus. All right. Help! Bath, please. Help! Oh, are you going to do it? We just got a puppy, and I think my mom is mad at the puppy. <laughs> uh, all right. I like how one blowout and her plum bobs immediately the darkest of reds. All right, how are we doing over here? You do probably have to wake up pretty soon. I don't want to burst your bubble, but go ahead and let's just serve some food so that you have something to eat later. You do that. Great. Now, Wednesday. I really wish they were in day of the week order. I don't know why they're not, because I made them in day of the week order. Go ahead and take me to bed. And then who is this on the floor here? That is Tuesday. I also put them in rainbow order so this wouldn't happen, but... And Megumi can carry you to bed. Ooh, woohoo, cooing. Good for you. Slept through the night. I mean, yeah. Not really, but okay. Alright, no, no. Oh man, everybody's having blowouts. Alright, you gotta figure something out. Alright. You really didn't get any rest, so I'm not really sure what happened with that, but um, go ahead and give this one a bath. Whichever, whichever one that is. And then, Megumi, you gotta help us a little bit. Great. Ruby, you do that. Man, her knees are gonna be messed up. Can you even imagine having seven kids, especially seven babies, all at the same time? Oh my god. Be awful. I mean, and I love kids, but I couldn't do babies, really at all. Much less seven. What is this? Chrysanthemum. Alright. I'm sure you are stressed. Uh, <laughs> when do you go to work? 19 hours. We might send them to daycare when we're at work, because obviously this is too much for one nanny to keep them all alive, so... Um, We'll probably send them to daycare instead of hiring the nanny whenever we do that. All right, keep bathing them. Don't give up. All right, Megumi, do something. I'm trying to figure out which baby you have. Okay. All right, can you get a move on? What's going on? All right. Whoa, naked baby. That was crazy. All right, now go ahead and put her, all right, well, this is Sunday, I can see that. So put Sunday in here. Why can I not put Saturday in there? Saturday, is that who you are? Nope, you're Sunday. Let's put Sunday in there. Um, I do plan once they're actually humans to um, give them distinct personalities and stuff, so it's not this the whole time of me not, not being able to tell them apart. But there's with infants, there's really only so much you can do to actually make them look different, so I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> Alright. No. Help! Feed me! And... What do you need? Anything? Oh, everything. Help! We're at the feeding time again. Go, Ruby. Thank you. Okay. Thus far, we haven't had any threats of them being taken away, so I'm taking that as a win. <laughs> oh, good God. Okay. <laughs> Alright, hold on. She's crashing, and she's no help to us if she's crashing, so you go sleep for a little bit, and Megumi's got this. Great. You do that. You do that. Are you gonna sleep, or no? You don't need to cry, dog. Just sleep. Can you guys tell how good of a mom I'd be in real life? <laughs> You don't need to cry, dog. First bath mo uh, mo First bath milestone. Great. All right, let mommy sleep for a little bit. And then, do we even have a trash can? <laughs> okay. And okay. And then I am gonna get the trash can that burns your stuff and gives you money. Cause we're gonna be getting rid of a lot of diapers, I'm sure. And it's my favorite trash can in the game. I put it in almost everything I build, if you guys haven't noticed. Um, wonderful. When you're done with that, she can feed you. And everyone else is asleep. Shh. <coughs> All right. Yeah, you're sleeping. You're actually doing pretty good Saturday. Sunday's doing all right. Friday's getting a bath. Wonderful. Monday's sleeping. 
Tuesday is sleeping and Wednesday is sleeping. Excellent. Excellent indeed. And we gotta let her sleep for a bit because this is not gonna work otherwise. Once they're all asleep, I will finish it up for the day. <laughs> Call it a win. Uh, yeah, go ahead and put me to bed. Don't put me down. Put me to bed, please. Okay. Their needs aren't all perfect, but all seven are asleep. The nanny's on standby. Mom is asleep. So I think for this first episode, I'm going to call it there. And um, I will come back to this very soon and do a part two. Um, I think this went well, and I'm excited to see where it goes. I'm excited to hopefully figure out more about Ruby as a person as well as a mom and mainly survive these first few days in infancy. But then after that, it'll be toddlerhood, then child, then teenager, and then the Let's Play will be complete. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed this, feel free to like it, comment, um, subscribe, do all of that stuff, and stick around and watch out for a part two. Thank you guys. Bye.